Well, it's interesting because there's a hadith from Imam Jafar Sadiq, and he says yes, um, that mm -hmm. one should smell an apple before eating it. Have you ever smelt an apple before eating mm. it? Maybe the, I'm thinking, I haven't, but I'm thinking the aroma does have, you know, like aromatherapy, so yeah. it smells of things. Yeah. I mean, you, you can imagine walking in a marketplace or something, you smell something yeah. and, it, and it affects your mood or, so, you know, nice smells, foods, you come indoors or the smell of fresh fruit, or you come indoors and mum's cooking something like, you know, it sets a mood. So I can, I can, I can appreciate mm. that one about smelling an apple and maybe uh, um, not taking for granted what the gifts from Allah, you yeah. know, that is like but I think natural fruit, natural fruit, I know when we've been to um, Middle East, the fruit there, because of, I suppose, of not being sprayed by so many um, pesticides, it has such a strong aroma, sweet, and you can actually smell the, you know, strawberries and the grape, everything's amazingly, you know, beautiful. And um, and I think with apples as well, but pine, I've, I've smelled melons. Mm -hmm. I think if you smell the base of the melon, you can actually get the sweetness of it. And how sweet the fruit will be. So it's amazing what you can, what your nose can pick up. Mm -hmm, um, mm -hmm.